Hello guys, uh, welcome to another food review. We have never been here. This is called Taco Pizza. Um, we've been to the La Siesta over there. It's a, a Mexican restaurant. I'm not sure if they own this one as well, but heard some good things about uh, it on Hernando's Happenings on Facebook. Uh, so just right around the corner, we're gonna go inside, and check it out. All right, we got our food. Um, I had to do a couple takes over because I, uh, the menu is gone, so I don't know how much exactly all this is. I'll give you a rough estimate what I what I, I remember I think it is, and then I'll put the um, menu up after I talk about all this so you, you can know. Uh, but we do have the house salad, uh, the ravioli, the house salad, and the bread knots came as one. Uh, I think that was only, I want to say $9.99. But for that, that, and that, that seems pretty cheap. But, we, we, but like I said, I'll put the menu up later. Uh, the house salad comes with cucumbers, tomatoes, red onions, pepperoncinis, uh, the croutons. I think it has mozzarella cheese or feta cheese, one of the two cheeses in there, topped with the ranch. Uh, this is beef ravioli. Um, it has cheese, the red sauce. Uh, I'm not really sure what kind of cheese. Maybe mozzarella. Uh, but. And then the uh, garlic knots are bread with the garlic on it. Uh, we did get the buffalo wings. Uh, these uh, are, they have three different kinds of wings. We did get the buffalo wings. They are 10 for $11.99 and it comes with a little uh, sauce of ranch. I think you could probably get blue cheese as well, but, but uh, Tasha's not a fan of blue cheese. Um, we're getting ranch. Uh, the pizza. We have here a, a 16 inch pizza, it's a taco pizza. Uh, it comes with uh, hamburger meat, lettuce, and tomato. It's kind of like a, a taco on a pizza. A taco on a pizza. And uh, no sour cream though. I guess you could probably add that. If you wanted to, you wouldn't, um, no? Yeah. Okay, well um, that I think is $13.49 for a 16 inch, but they do have uh, two different sizes. So, no, a 12 inch. They have a, a, a 15 and an 18, maybe. I'm not sure. I'll put the, I'll put that up. Uh, let me let me cut this volume down, um, and we'll get started here. Okay. Um, you could you could. I'll just eat some salad real quick. I know everybody knows what the salad tastes like, but. Uh, That and that's their house dressing too, I think. They're made here. It's fresh. Mm -hmm. It's good. And I still can't believe all this would be $9.99. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna bank on you guys looking at the uh, menu for me. You want a garlic nut? Sure. Thank you. Yeah, the place not hot no more because I had to do a couple of takes and uh, I'm trying to figure out all my lies before I, I, I cut, cut the record button on. I don't think I've had ravioli from a restaurant before because normally it'd be uh, like a pork, a sausage or something. Like a pork, yeah. It's, it's good that they had the beef ones. You tell it's fresh that they did this here. This is fresh uh, pasta. Yeah. 
That sauce is really good. It is good. It's like a fresh tasting pasta sauce. I'm just gonna get a, another half of one and leave her the rest because she might want that pasta for later at work. That is really good. Yeah, it tastes like they made these ravioli in set because they're kind of, I don't know, the pasta's kind of thick. You could tell, I mean, you could tell this made here the way you're, you're talking about. I don't want to say rubbery. I don't want to say that word. No, it's not rubbery. It's, uh, it's like fresh. Al dente. Yeah, Al dente. They, it's, it's not, it's not hard. That's what she said. That's what she said. That's what she said. A lot of times you get these and they're just hard and they're not. It's really good. Really fresh. Okay. And chicken wings. If you're a flat or a drumette, uh, a wingette or a drumette, please let me know what you prefer. I'm People more of. Like all flats. I like flats. I just like chicken. But at contest, I like drumettes. I like that um that buffalo sauce they have. Mm -hmm. The only the only thing I'm gonna say because you know how I like mine. I like mine a crisper. And then tossing the sauce, but a lot of people do it this way. I mean, it's good. But it seems like they work. Like it's good. They are. But I like a little more crisp to it. Crispy. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes what I do, I'll do it and then put it back in the pan, like a little bit of butter, and then cook that coating back on it so it's like caramelized. I'm a fan. They're good. But also, these wings aren't expensive. As expensive as. Uh, Everything good? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Much fun? Uh-uh. They're not as expensive as most wing places than having their wings. To me, I mean, well, the prices now are a little higher, but um, because of COVID, but this is like a do like a dollar five a piece. I think that's that's kind of like an average, maybe. Some places are a little higher. Yeah, some are a little higher than that. I know some people on here say that uh, they can get wings like 25 cents or 50 cents. Like, I don't know where you're going. I, I don't know. I, like, I wouldn't trust those wings if they're that cheap. But Maybe they don't the little wings like we did Taco Bell. Pennsylvania wings, I call them. Uh -huh. They're like pigeons. Because the, 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 the wing bowl, they have like little bitty wings. They're like, what kind of chicken are those? Okay. We are to the pizza now. Do you like buffalo wings? I suggest getting getting those. Now the pizza. She's getting it, guys. <laughs> She's dainty with it. I'm just gonna rip it apart and then have half of it on the have half of it left on yeah, the. Yeah, I was trying not to spill all the toppings. I like the crust. Oh, it has a nice little, uh, it's not like hard crust and it's not real soft. It has a little bit of, uh, a little bit of char on it, I would say. Mm -hmm. This is pretty good. They have lettuce and tomatoes on it. Yeah, the, um, the crust, if it was a little harder, it probably would have, uh, this stuff, the toppings wouldn't fall off as much, I guess, but if you fold it, you have yeah, to fold it. I guess what New York people do. Don't New York fold the pizza? I don't know. I've never been. I, mean, I saw on TV, maybe. I haven't watched people, like, stared at them. I think uh, Bob does it, though. Don't he do it in Philadelphia? He's like, I don't fold. Know. It's, it's pretty good. 
and the owners of this are the owners of a couple of uh, Mexican restaurants here. Mm -hmm. so. I told them outside the La Siesta that's down just on the same um, business, this little shopping mall here. Uh, that's the first Mexican restaurant we came here when, when we came. They, they were really good. Um, and I've done a couple of videos at Subway in the same shopping uh, mall area. There's a, a Subway down the, the, the block. This is 64 West Commerce, I believe. And Hernando here. I'm going to get one more piece, piece of pizza. This pizza yeah. is a big slice here. I think they forgot to cut this one, and I'm going to go for that. It's called One Slice. It's One Slice. But if you're in the area, try out their, their pizza. They have, yeah, they have a, a stuffed pizza. They said uh, it was the best seller at stuffed pizza. Yeah, but, we asked. That was his best seller. Yeah, stuff. best seller. That was like 21 and some change, I think, for a... They don't have a small one that one. They have a medium. I think the small might, might be just too much, too much crust. Maybe if it's a small, it'd be too much. So they sell a medium and a large in that. I wasn't expecting the ravioli to be as seasoned as whatever sauce. Like if they make that in house, that is good. Which I'm pretty sure they may yeah. make everything in house well, here. Like, I used to say the best like, bang for your buck, like what I order on the table, I'm not sure of the whole the restaurant, but what I'm seeing, if this is $9.99, the ravioli, the salad, and the knots would be a really good, really good bargain. But, when Brandon first told me about this place, and he was like, it was like the yeah, La Siesta taco pizza. In my mind, I just saw a giant Mexican pizza. That's what I was like. I thought but it was not just... not like a pizza, like taco, like how we got it. I was thinking something totally different. I'm not disappointed, though, because it's very good. I have a lot of pastas, a lot of Italian foods here. And when I was thinking taco pizza, I was thinking like all Mexican. But mm -hmm. I was surprised, but pleasantly surprised, that uh, that the food is good. So, uh, with that said, uh, we'll definitely be back to try some uh, paninis and some different stuff that they have. Mm -hmm. They have a lot of different uh, foods here. As I uh, put that menu up on the back side as well uh, of, of stuff, with the front side, just to put it up again for you guys to see. So. I appreciate it very much. Uh, we're going to go ahead and enjoy the rest of this without the camera interface and the microphone. Uh, is there any other thing that you wanted to add? Or? Mm -mm. Huh? Okay. Just if you had their Mexican, because they're a good Mexican restaurant as well. But if you try tried that, give them a try at their, their pizza place. He said they've been here uh, a month. Yep. So they're, they're freshly new here, and I think they might have had but one. But he said, they, they, as far as the Mexican restaurants go, they've been here 10 years. 10 years, okay. Well, they're going to be a lot longer with food like this. So yeah. uh, thank you very much, guys, for uh, watching the video. Please uh, like, share, subscribe. Uh, really appreciate it. And until the next video, talk to you later. Go post up recording. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visit my website yet um the the address is www.dougarbagedisposalstore.com you can navigate through the top all these links right here um there is actually a question and comment form if you have any questions or comments uh, fill that out and it'll go straight to my email at the very bottom there is a free newsletter just sign up for right here um and you'll get a weekly newsletter so uh if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you, so I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss, and have a great day. Let's meet other plans.